Hi everyone, it's Gail. I am back with my altered book here and I'm going to do some work in that today. I want to say hi and hugs to Amanda, Jason, and Allison. Jason and Allison go together. Um, tickles me beyond belief that Jason and Allison um, watch my videos. Jason is a really good pal of my son's. So Hello, hi, and hugs, and we're going to work in this some more today. Um, I have lots to catch up on. You might have noticed there was a little gap, I think only a day, in my videos, and so I apologize to my daily watchers, but um, I have lots to tell you about what was going on. So I think I did a couple things on this. I did put in some cards. I can't remember if I did that on camera or not that were made by Melissa Sullivan. Um, she is Texas Freckles on Etsy, and they were in my journal that I keep correspondence in. So I loved how she put fabric on them, and so um, they, are, they are going in some pockets. I think I did all that. Um, I think I may have done this without you, this page, and I just, used coffee dyed paper, covered the text, and just glued on a couple things. And then made this into a pocket, again, with one of Melanie's awesome journaling cards in there. So that is that. And then um, I, just, I just put a little paper over the text there. So not sure if we're gonna do something more on that. And this has been made into a pocket. These were illustrations that were already in the book. So that's been made into a pocket. So this then becomes the next pocket page. And this is going to be the back of it because we've got another illustration. So what I'm going to do is take out all of these pages because there's... There's more than six for sure, but I mean, it's already getting chunky, so I need to be ruthless with my, um, with my page taking out. <laughs> so um, anyway, there you go. I hope everyone had a lovely Easter. Um, mine was, let's just say it was eventful, and thus the break in my videos. So... Um, my daughter and her family came up from, from Bozeman, which is about an hour and a half from our house to spend the holiday. And they came up Saturday and Saturday night in the middle of the night, my daughter got very ill. So... We were up all night Saturday night, and then finally at about 6 in the morning, um, her husband took her to the emergency room. She, um, I, I have cleared it with her to talk about what ha is going on with her. Um, you all, th those of the, you that have followed me for a while know that last fall, um, we had a lot going on with her and we're trying to figure out what was going on with her. Well, I didn't say what was wrong because it really wasn't my story to tell, but she encouraged me to talk about it with all of you because she is all about educating people about her disease. So last fall, she was diagnosed with, uh-oh, she was diagnosed with Crohn's disease. And so she has been battling that and it is a battle. Um, the medications for the disease, first of all, they are absolutely out of this world expensive, but beyond that, the last two that she's tried, she's allergic to. She breaks out in a horrible rash all over her body. So, so there's that. We're gonna have to fix that little tear. So, um, anyway, that has been going on with her. She was, so she was in, 
We had two emergency visits on Easter and then she was admitted to the hospital. Um, okay, so those two are gonna stay together. I'm gonna clip those both together. And then we're gonna start on the next one. I just wanna get a few ready to go and then we'll start working. So this will be the beginning of the pocket. And then I don't think we have any, don't have any, oh yes we do. There's one right there. So, okay, so this is just going to be a few torn out. So this will be the back of the pocket, and we'll tear these ones out. Um, anyway, she was admitted to the hospital, and that was Sunday. Today is Wednesday. She was released last night and stayed the night at our house. And then I took her home today, and... Um, so I've been driving back and forth to her town because um, her husband and daughters went back Sunday night because, you know, they had, they had school. So they had to get back. Um, and then yesterday, my youngest granddaughter got braces on, which was a big deal. And she... Um, really wanted somebody to be there that was a family member, you know. So I drove over and did that yesterday, came back, then um, drove over again to take my daughter. Okay, that is the end of the pictures for a while. We've got all of this, so that's awesome. Um, yeah, so this is going to be the beginning of the pocket, and then I'm going to take at least one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I'm going to take ten pages in between is what I'm going to do, just because it's getting chunky. Um, well, it's way easier for me to talk and tell you my story when I'm tearing out pages. Yeah, so anyway, oh, bless her heart, and... Um, Yesterday morning, she'd had too many IV fluids, and she had fluid in her lungs, and oh my goodness, it is something. So anyway, all that is going on, and in the meantime, I don't have permission to talk much about it, but my husband's having some health challenges too. So all that to say, I've been, I've been being mom and, and wife, and taking care of stuff. So that's why you haven't seen me until now. I mean, I only missed a day, but that was because I did videos way ahead for Easter. And then I kind of kept going. And so I had Monday and Tuesday too. So as far as I know, today is the only day that we're going to be missing being together and crafting. But boy, oh boy, am I glad to be in my craft room. <laughs> so, um, you know, it just occurs to me how how lucky we are to have this endeavor that really it's a uh, it's it's healing. I mean, I could not wait to get to my craft room and to be with all of you and everything today. I just could hardly wait. Okay, so here was the last pocket we made. Now we've got a good bit of um, of pages in between we can work on, but this one's going to end up being kind of the double spread type of deal, you know, like this. So I thought we'd work on that today. What I'd like to do with this pocket is just is do something a little different than we've done yet. I had this one going at an angle. And I think what I'm going to do with this one is just fold this down and have it be a pocket there. I'm I'm looking at that going. Actually, you could you could probably just journal on that page, couldn't you? But I probably won't leave it. I probably won't leave it. I don't know how deep I want my pocket. I don't know what I want to put in my pocket, so maybe that's why. You know, I'm just going to go like that and have it that deep. So then we're kind of working on this, we're kind of working on this, and then we're working on the back of the pocket too. 
So anyway, I hope you don't mind me catching up, catching you up on all my family goings on. Mmm. I tell you, the hardest thing is, you know, the, not much sleep. But, you know, let's see. Let me think for a minute on this before I start blabbing. So this was AOZA. So I am going to, and I'll try and put all these people in the description box. I was trying to avoid that because I just wanted to freely work with stuff I had. But then I get all the questions. So I'll try and put most people in there that I'm working with. Um, let's, let's do antique papery this time on these two pages. I thought if we, if we did them kind of in a spread, then they would, it would be kind of cool. So gorgeous papers from antique papery. Love them all, but let's see, let's see which one is speaking to us today. So what I was saying is even with the, you know, it's, it's awful. It was awful to see her in the amount of pain she was in. Oh, you know, you just want to take it for yourself and, you know, Ooh, that's pretty. Ooh, I kind of like those ones. And there's lots of butterfly ones. So if we needed more, there's more. I th I'm sure this is from kind of from one kit. Okay. Well, let's just put these ones uh, above and um, on, on the very top of the pile there and play with these a little bit. Um, anyway, uh, there are always blessings though, was what I was getting at. Um, so, so my son came over from, he lives in the opposite direction an hour and a half and he came over. That would be nice right there. Wouldn't it just kind of, yeah, gosh. That her collages are so pretty. It's like you could just put that on there and be done. But I, I want to play a little more than that. So, okay. Well, let's let's start ripping. And I still don't have any different scissors. You know what? I also saw somebody use. Um, somebody was using a. Uh, it was like a, a quilters thing. Um, ruler thing and I think I have one of those somewhere too so it's kind of like I just need to need to have time to figure out my tearing stuff because this is sort of working but not really if I put it on its edge it's better but still have slippage um anyway my son came over bless his heart because he has a uh, technology job where if there's internet he can work there so he just thought he would um, come over and work from her hospital room so he did that which of course made me weak in the knees he's such a sweetheart he brought her flowers and everything he's just he's just a really really nice man <laughs> and um yeah, so, and he takes really good care of his sisters, which, you know, when you get older, it's really nice if if you know that about your kids, that they're going to kind of, they're going to watch out for each other and take care of one another when you're gone type of thing, you know? Okay, okay, I'm loving that. I think I'm going to go right on the side of this rose because... This butterfly isn't going to fit on the page irregardless, so that's just not. It's too big. Let's see. Come over and get this away. See how that looks right there. That's nice, isn't it? Okay, well, I want something under for sure. And then I there I might do something on this too. I don't know exactly what yet, but we'll figure something out. Okay. I'm actually thinking 
about looking oh my gosh my big old my big old thing of papers my goodness I thought it would go down with the collaging. I think it's gone. It's gone the other way. I think there's more. I was kind of thinking of some graph paper. Okay. I'm just going to leave that down on the floor by our side. I had to clean completely up in my craft room over Easter because um, I knew my granddaughters would want to play. And they did. They wanted to play. So, um, so yeah. Maybe put it there. About there. I don't even know. I don't even know what I'm doing. I'm just playing. Um, anyway, my oldest granddaughter, uh, she received... Uh, in her Easter basket, she got a bullet journal. Oh my gosh. And she's the one, you know, that I showed you. Well, I showed you some of her writing. I can't grab it right now, but like this is the, this is the Easter card that she made us. She's just, she's just a talented little thing. Her name's Addie. Look at how she writes it. I love it. Anyway, she, um, she got a bullet journal and oh my gosh, that and a pack of markers and she was in hog heaven. She was really having fun with those. So that was cool. And then, um, <clears throat> and then I had her also, she had, she hadn't made a tag for double digits baby book yet. So I had her do that too. So she was down here playing and and that's when I did a couple things like got these pockets together and stuff. I don't get a, very much done when they're in my craft room only because I'm, you know, busy grabbing them things and, you know, Nana wears this or that or, you know, whatever. But, oh my gosh, I love it. And actually, Saturday night, my daughter was down here too. Um... She and the oldest one, they were doing watercolor poppies. <laughs> and so, um, so that was cool. And I have to tell you, that's the first time that my daughter has ever played. My daughter-in-law has been in my craft room and done some art journal pages and stuff. But none of my daughters ever have. And so, I mean, I took pictures. It was like, it was like an event for me to have her down here. I loved it. And um, I was just kind of, I was sitting in the corner doing fussy cutting because I just wanted to watch them, you know. Yeah, it was fun. Okay, I'm loving that. You know what? I think I better ink that first before I put it down. You guys are so funny on my last video. Go ahead and ink, Gail. Don't you feel bad about inking. And I, I don't feel bad about it. I just wish that I could be happy with it not inked because, you know, it's an extra step. But but I'm just, I'm just not as happy with how it looks. So I just continue to take the time, which is fine. So, um, but thank you for for you know your permission <laughs> guys, crack me up oh my gosh some of your comments really literally have me laughing out loud <clears throat> it's just so fun um yeah so i have a collage digital just about ready i just i need to i need to get it scanned and get the listings done for Etsy. I hope, hope to do that. I maybe can get it done tomorrow. I hope because I want to use some of that in this book too. So, but I got to get, it, I got to get it done and listed so that I can use it. Okay. Well, I really like that. I'm just kind of thinking I want to do like, I guess you could say the base 
the base of this page and this page before I do anything else collage wise on them. Um, I also really loved this and I think having that dark down here will kind of balance that a little bit, if you will. So I'm going to go ahead and fight with my ruler again. <laughs> I'll try and be more prepared tomorrow. Although tomorrow I really need to do a Happy Mail video. I'm behind on my Happy Mail videos and I can hardly move in my room. So I need to get those filmed so I can get things put away and stuff, you know. It's, it's not great, but it's not like I wanted it perfectly straight because if I did, I'd just cut it. So there you go. Okay, maybe we'll do this edge too. Ah, uh, let's see. What else? Oh my gosh. I'm telling you, it's exhausting spending the whole day in the um, hospital. Although, while my daughter was sleeping, I was able to... Um, get on to their Wi-Fi and answer comments and stuff. So I'm glad I had you guys to keep me occupied. Oh my goodness. <laughs> this is disaster. Really need to fix this up. Really do. Okay, good enough. Good enough. Whatever. Just tear this part off. <laughs> okay. So... Okay, a little sip. Oh, so good. Now, this is the one that I tore. <clears throat> so, I'm definitely going to want to get something really glued down there. I think what I'm going to do is... Just kind of put a little line right there and see how we how we do tearing it up tearing it up that side okay it might it'll be easier because it's um not so tiny see how see how well that works when it's not such a tiny little strip works so much better okay and then I guess I better make a mark on this side as well I think I kind of want that right down there. There's a little edge right there because then the butterfly can be on there. So I'm just going to give that a little there. And I guess I'll go I'll use the digitals marking as a as where I want to tear that off. Yep. It's amazing how well it works when there's something to grab onto. Okay, those can go in the bits. Look how pretty that, just that little piece is. Yeah, I think we'll, we'll just do that like that, but I want to ink the pocket. And then we'll see what looks good on the, on the underside of the pocket, if you will. Oh, this feels so good. All the way home today after taking my daughter, I thought, okay, I got to figure out something to keep me, keep me going and get me home. So I turned on the Comedy Central channel on Sirius, which um, got me, got me down the road. I mean, yesterday and today, actually both beautiful days to be on the road, but that was a lot of miles in a couple days for this girl who normally doesn't leave her craft room much. <laughs> oh, leave it to my kids to get me out of my comfort zone and just get me, get me going down the road. 
Oh, and you know, as I said, my husband's having health issues, so he wasn't able to come with me at all. So, so it goes. Life, it's always interesting, isn't it? Never boring, never boring. All right. Ooh, I like that. That is pretty. Okay. So then, this one, I really like. I'm, I'm not wild about that little lady, so I might clip her off. But this whole part would be pretty. But I think I'm going to go with, let's see. Did it, where did I put it in my little, my little bucket up there? I think I want some of this up here to kind of balance. So I'm going to do that. Okay. So um, as well with all of my goings on, I have had to cancel the two retreats that other people were putting on that I was scheduled to go to. I had to cancel out of both of them. The one is this weekend, which I have to, I need to go back to my daughter's town and help out with the girls' sports because um, they are different ages. So, of course, they're in two different places. And so I need to do that. And then the following weekend is another one. Um, but my son is graduating with his second master's and so we want to be a graduation and with everything my husband has going on a lot of, he's got a lot of tests and a biopsy and whatnot right around that time so so I'm not going to do that either um which is fine because I'm mentally not at a place where I could really enjoy it you know it's it feels like another thing to do, kind of a stressor almost. So let's see. I can go. Really right about there and cut and then with that. Um, maybe as well, I will. Maybe I'll just go right above the butterfly. You just use that part. I like this part and that part, so I'm not sure which one I want to use. But um, yeah. So anyway, um, those two retreats are off my off my radar. And then, um, oh, what I'm gonna do is. Um, you know, I have, I have the retreat that, oh yeah, I miss out on all of that. Okay, here's what I'm going to do. About right there. Okay, I am going to rip this off. And then I'm going to rip off this lady. <laughs> there um okay 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 so anyway um the one that I am hosting will still be happening but I'm just gonna go ahead and skip the other two which you know I hate to do but sometimes sometimes life just gets in your way and and it really has. <laughs> it really has. Okay. So, yeah. I think I'll stick that down there. And then um, I need something in the middle, which we can, we can come up with. Um, yeah. So, anyway. So, I freed up my two weeks, which was actually really great because I just don't know what my daughter's going to need too, you know? Um, 
I mean, her husband does a great job, but he is, he's an optometrist and he's self-employed. So if he misses work, that's that. And with the issue of my daughter's medication being completely and utterly ridiculously expensive, he can't do that either. So it's, it's nice if I can help out. I'm kind of thinking about putting the other half of this butterfly right here to put, kind of, once again, kind of pull the pages together. I think I'm going to do that. And just kind of put it sticking out like that. Yep, that's what I'm going to do. Yeah, so I, but I am doing good. I, um, I think I've caught up on the missing sleep. That's, that's what does me in is if I don't, if I don't get good sleep, oh my gosh, then, then I can't really function, which was, <laughs> which was where I was at when I was calling my friends and telling them I couldn't go to the retreats. I was like, oh. <laughs> I was bawling. Oh my gosh. But yeah, sometimes life is overwhelming and you just got to cry about it. <laughs> oh, so, but doing good now. I'm glad my daughter's home. She can see her own doctor and stuff and, and, um, hopefully they can come up with some sort of a game plan, um, for her. And, okay, so that one's a pocket on that side, so I don't have to worry about really any writing space, although this whole space could be written in if somebody wanted to. Okay. Just going to tone down that white a little bit. Okay, so that is those two. I just wonder what else I want to do, if anything, to them. I don't know. I don't know. Let's do this. Let's make this an actual pocket with the, this is the art glitter glue. Been getting questions again. I have a whole video on glues if you're interested. So, um, it's so funny. Uh, what I'm learning <laughs> from from my subbies is I can do a video on something and I think, okay, well, I've done that. So now everybody knows. Well, everybody doesn't know because they may not have seen that particular video. So I'm starting to learn that I just need to say it over and over and over, which is repetitive for those who watch me every day. But, but, um, might cut down on the questions from people too. I don't know. So anyway, the art glitter glue I get on Etsy. There's various sellers and there's various people that sell these little toppers too. Which, um, and I think Tracy Fox also has a tutorial on how to make those. So, and I'm going to have to have a page in here for Tracy, too. So, so far today I've talked about Aosia and Antique Papery. Okay. So, then the, the actual um, writing space will be something in this pocket. Now... I am using quite a few of these from Melanie, but I'm also thinking, um, where are, I don't know if I have them in here or somewhere else, but what I'm looking for is my vintage envelopes digitals. Oh, I've got the, I do have some. 
of my vintage receipts printed out. I think maybe that would be nice in there. Um, what did I do? What did I do with my vintage envelopes? This is another, I mean, I have, <laughs> I have multiple things going of, oh, here they are. Here they are. There's my vintage envelopes. I was thinking one of those might be nice too. In there. This one's kind of cut up because I made some stuff with it already. Um, I think I like this one. And I like how that red might... Let's cut it out and see if we like it better than the receipt. And then I'll put those back into my, um, my other folder here. So I don't have to look for them next time. I really want to thank those of you too that continue to support my Etsy through the digital purchasing the digitals, even when I haven't shown them recently. That's really so kind of you. I really do appreciate it. Okay, so there's that one. And let's put the rest back in my file of my digitals. I'll put them behind the doilies, maybe. I'm right about there. I also have some eco-dyed ones in there that might be fun along the way on this. Okay, so that's that one, which of course we would ink and stuff. Nope, I like this one. I like how the red ties in. Kind of thought I would. All right. So I think all we're going to do to this guy, really, I mean, we could decorate him up a little bit. But I'm thinking I might like a tab. I might like a tab on him. Let's just get him even more vintage than his 1909 vintage self. <laughs> Isn't it funny to think one day people may be, I don't know, grabbing our correspondence and thinking it's old and cool. That was kind of funny today, driving back, um, my daughter back, I said, so is there a radio station you like to listen to? And she said, yeah, this one. I really like it because they play like lots of 90s music. And I said, oh, yeah, from, you know, from your high school years and everything. And, and, she, <laughs> and she said, you realize, Mom, that the 1990 was t 29 years ago. <laughs> and I'm like, Oh, wow. That's just craziness. <laughs> oh. Yeah. It's, I guess time flies, doesn't it? Okay. So if I'm going to make a little tab for that, let me put my book up over here for a quick second. Um, I think I'll use these papers from Melanie, our cardstock. Ooh, and this one I've already cut into. What else do we have? Let me get these out and let's look for a second. Ugh. At what? They are bright and happy, aren't they? And she's got the quilt and she's got it in different sizes, different colors. This is the best color for that page, I think. Almost maybe this one. We should get a small one there too. Hmm. I think I might do. I'm 
looking at the colors in the collages and deciding I think I'd actually like this right here which of course it's right in the middle um, but I think I'm just gonna grab this let's see what will I Ooh, that really doesn't tear very well. Kind of tears. Okay. <clears throat> All right, so did that. Let's put this back here. Oh my goodness, my desk. As usual, mid-project gets a little crazy. Okay, let me grab my tab punch. Come here, come here. And kind of want it this way. Okay, if I go like that, I'm okay. Okay. Let's do this way. <laughs> Jeez. Talk about uncoordinated, huh? Okay. Right out of the middle. That's okay. Right. We'll use the rest of it. For this is and that. Okay. That's pretty, though. So helpful though if you really if you fold it in half correctly. <laughs> oh yeah. So anyway, my daughter of course made me feel old today. <laughs> She's telling me, "Oh, let's do the let's do the '90s." Yeah, that's 39 years ago, Mom. Oh, really? How'd that happen? 29, not 39. 29. Okay, so I think I want to put that there. Then we can decide what else, if anything. So, yeah, so I listened to 90s on the way down and Comedy Central on the way back, which Comedy Central is a little bit racy. Lots of bad words. But there were a few times that I laughed out loud and I thought, you know what? It's making me not think about the drive. I'm just going. And so I went with it. Just went with it. Okay. So what do we have for little pieces that are left over here? I think I might put that there just for fun. That there. That there. And then maybe we could put a stamp or something. I don't know. Just fancy it up just a, t a little tiny bit. Okay, so let me talk about this. Let's talk about nurses who seriously are angels on earth. I really do feel like they are. They, um, they were just so wonderful to my daughter. So wonderful. And... She got really, really good care and everything. And, you know, I mean, granted she was in her hometown, but she was still away from home now, you know, that she's a grown-up and lives somewhere else. And, um, gosh, they were great. She, um, you know, she's one of the healthiest, <laughs> most health-conscious people I know. And isn't it weird that someone like that would get a chronic illness? But um, she, uh, she, you know, she 
she doesn't feel right unless she exercises every day. And, um, oh, this was kind of loose. Maybe that's because it wants to be on here. Um, anyways, <laughs> and the days were, be you know, it was beautiful outside. And so my daughter, I think I'm going to do that. My daughter talked him into letting her walk outside, <laughs> which is not usually done. But, you know, she just needs her exercise. And so, let's see, it was Monday when I was at the hospital from 7 in the morning until 10 at night. And uh, we walked around the hallways, but then we walked outside too. And I came home and I had to take ibuprofen when I went to bed. I thought, oh my gosh, Gail, you are in seriously poor shape. <laughs> Where do I want that? I kind of wanted it there, but now I think I want it about halfway down there. Don't want it even. Okay, let's just go with that. Okay, that's fun. I'm kind of wishing I would have put something under there. But I didn't. I didn't do it. I think I might put some lace across there. Just because I could. Gonna do it. Um, yeah, so anyway. I don't even know what I was talking about. Talking about my daughter talking to me. And her, let, springing her for a little bit of a nice walk in the sunshine. Yeah, and it about d did her mom in. I'm just like, oh my goodness. The one that's in the hospital is like running circles around me. Yeah, so we did that. I have no idea what the time is. I haven't even checked, have I? No idea. I missed you guys. We'll be doing a two-hour video. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Let's see. Oh, 47 minutes. We were doing good. And we did a page in here. Excited about that. Yeah, I like that little piece of lace on there. That was a good idea. Okay, and then there's just a little journaling space there. And this one, we got to find something to go into that one because it's ready. I'm thinking I'd like to do, because I really want to use these, but I need a side one. What's this one? Ooh, that's cute. I don't know. Not quite not quite enough going on. Like this one I like. With That's nice, isn't it? That looks nice there. Okay. So, we have that in there, that there, that there. And then this is going to be another just another pocket so we could get that ready. And then we'll need to do something over here. I love that page. It's fairly simple. I mean, I didn't fancy it up too much. I think it needs a label right there. That's that's what that quiet moment was <laughs> was about, was me thinking, hmm, I think it needs a label. I decided I need to make another one of these. And I'm going to follow Roxy Creations videos on it. Um, because I think I could just put stamps in this one. And put the labels, because see, look at how fat it is. It's just absolutely bulging with labels. Ooh, I like that because it kind of looks like that, doesn't it? Yep. That's what she needed. That's what she needed. 
why is it that when it needs something, it seems like it's it needs a label? <laughs> but um, yeah, I have I can't remember what I was talking about now. Oh well, I am scattered. I'll tell you, the first couple of days, my brain was not working at all. So if any of you all got weird answers to your comments, that's just because I was stressed out and I just wasn't myself. <laughs> oh. Okay. Yes, let's do this. This is going to be put that right there. Ooh, I like it. I like it. I like it. Okay. And then you, mister, I think I'm going to put, make you a top loading pocket. So let's give you a little, little bit of a cut on the top. It's hard. To, it's hard, kind of hard to get to the middle of these right there. We're going to go with it. Okay. And then I'm going to ink it and think about what we would like sticking out the top. And kind of would like to complement the colors in the photo a little bit. So I think once I get done doing the video and start getting it loaded on YouTube, I think my husband and I are going to go for a little walk because that would be good. So nice out. Oh, I love spring so much. Okay. Yep. That's good. Okay, well, let's glue that. So we're just going to do the bottom and the side because I want it to be a, a top loader. Okay. Perfect. Then I need to probably clean up so that I can do a happy mail video tomorrow. Yeah, that's good. I like that. Do we have a something that's kind of I love that one, but that's not really the colors. Ooh, this one's kind of like with the sky and the tree there. See if that'll fit down there all right. It sure does. See, and I'm going to have all kinds of fluff on both sides now, too. So that's awfully fun, too. So now we need to do this page. And we have to decide what kind of pocket we want here. This will be a side one. So I'll just kind of alternate those. Ooh, look. There's the card to go in. It jumped right out, too. All right. Well, let's do that. I think we have time to do that. And then figure out the pocket in between. Hey, I was kind of thinking the other night, I was kind of thinking, well, maybe you should go down and, and try and do a video. And then I'm like, oh my gosh, I would be incoherent. So I didn't do it. <laughs> I thought I better, I better not. Yeah. 
And I didn't want to mess up something in my book either. Because I, I really am having fun with this. It's just been a long time since I did an altered book. Okay. Yes, did that. Don't know what to do here yet. Could do one, one like that, except now. <laughs> I wonder if I did that. Could be a pocket there and a tuck there or something. That might be fun. I don't know. I don't know. I do know that that goes great right there. Perfect. Okay. So now it's just, it's getting fluffy. So thanks everybody so much for watching today. And thanks for listening to my story. I want you to know that when I am missing in action, it's usually going to be because... And, and haven't told you why, like I'm going on vacation or something. It's usually going to be something family related. So we did this. And we got a couple more pockets ready. This is so funky how it's... I'm going to have to straighten it out a little bit with my... With whatever we put on that page. And that one. Yeah coming along though. I love it. So we're going to have to figure out what we want to put on that page. Well, thanks guys. Thanks so much for being here. I, I hope I'm not too far from my usual self today. I'm, I'm getting better. I'm getting better. I'm not as worried and, um, I've had a little bit more sleep, so I'm getting a little better. Well, everybody, we will just see you next time. I think the next one will probably be a Happy Mail video catching up, and then we'll go from there. But thanks, everybody. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.